We're told 911 dispatchers handled more than 100 calls of shots fired at Highland High School. That was just after 7 o'clock in the morning. The sheriff says his deputies were on scene within minutes, but that the shooter had left by then. Now, here's a look at the suspect in this case. Because he's a juvenile, we're not showing his face or identifying him. He was picked up a short distance away from the school, and a rifle was found in a nearby open field. Investigators say the 14-year-old is a former Highland High student. He's accused of shooting a 15-year-old boy who goes to that school. That boy hit in the arm and is expected to make a full recovery. Sheriff Jim McDonald says they aren't sure if the student was specifically targeted or randomly hit. Now, even though Palmdale is sheriff's territory, it was actually an off-duty LAPD officer who found the suspected shooter. That officer is a friend of the family and was tipped off by the boy's mom. That he received a call from the subject. She told him they were having trouble with the subject who had run away from the house. The LAPD officer then got a call from the su subject's dad who said that the subject had just called him. The subject told the dad that he had shot his gun in the air and was headed toward Vaughn's. Now that's where the LAPD officer took him into custody. The investigation is still ongoing. They're trying to figure out why that boy opened fire, who the rifle belongs to, and why there were so many 911 calls of shots fired at an elementary school seven miles away. They're looking into the chance that it may have been a diversion to draw deputies away from the high school. Reporting live in Palmdale, Rob Hayes, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.